Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, a significant drop in the humidity levels since this morning. Very dry and comfortable this evening with temperatures still upper 60s to around 70. We take a peek outside, live pictures in Providence with the clear weather. West 70 about an hour ago, it's dropped off to 68 degrees. The dew point, which was rather high this morning, very humid. Had a couple of showers come through around 4 o'clock in the morning. It has dropped off on a light west-southwest breeze at 3 and the humidity coming in at 68%. High temps today, boy. Warm between 80 and 85 degrees. In fact, 86 in New Bedford, 85 in Taunton, made it up to 84 in Providence. Slightly cooler tomorrow. We're thinking a high in the upper 70s to around 80 degrees. Skies are clear, but notice off to our north and west, a few patchy clouds, and some of this will tend to work through tomorrow, so we'll have more of a cloud sun mixture rather than a deep blue sky but overall it looks very good if you earn a living working outdoors it's really a very comfortable day this blue line is just passed offshore it's a cool front the leading edge of not so much cooler air but rather drier air coming out of southeastern canada now draw your attention to the patch of clouds in upstate new york and northern new england uh, this will come through tomorrow but there'll be a lot of breaks in it so again it's more of a cloud sun mixture uh, for your thursday afternoon future casts Take a look at the overnight hours, looking at temperatures uh, dropping to the low and mid 60s by 5 o'clock in the morning with at least partly sunny skies. Nice start to the day tomorrow morning. Temperature between 66 and 73. Uh, dry conditions at sunrise at 513. So we'll go mostly sunny during the morning and then kind of a partly cloudy, partly sunny day in the afternoon. A lot of these cumulus clouds mixing in with the sunshine and the trend in temperature going up to the upper 70s to around 80 by about 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, Coastal temperatures, mid-70s, around 76, 77 degrees. Nice beach day. Bay uh, waters will be calm, uh, waves under a foot. Visibility pretty good uh, on a west breeze at 10 to 15. High tide, Newport Harbor, 743 in the morning. Low tide just after 1 o'clock in the afternoon. Beaches look nice with sunshine, dry conditions, air temperature at 77. If you've been paying attention to the water temperature, it's been going up now, upper 60s to near 70, and the safe sun time running at uh, 15 minutes. Northern suburbs away from any ocean influence, a little milder in the lower 80s. I think northern suburbs have a better chance of a cloud-sun mixture, whereas coastal areas will have more in the way of sunshine. Looking at a temperature of 80 in New Bedford and Fall River, Seekonk, beautiful Middletown, and that Little Compton. Taunton sunshine, or at least partly sunny skies in 81. Holiday weekend, still going with the same theme here of very warm with some sunshine. Uh, sunny skies on Saturday, 85. Warm and humid on Sunday, partly sunny sunny, a late afternoon or early evening shower or thunderstorm, though the day as a whole is looking okay. So I wouldn't cancel anything, though. Watch the sky late in the afternoon. Fourth of July, Monday, sunshine, warm, not as humid, with a high temperature up to 87, so looking pretty good. Partly cloudy on Friday, temperature at 80. Nice on Saturday, warm and humid on Sunday with a late day thunderstorm, sunshine for the fourth, and a high temperature running at about 87 degrees. On our website, WPRI.com, on the homepage, we have a list of all the 4th of July activities and firework displays, a popular link, so check it out. Should be fun. Thanks, Tony.